It's cool, Nathan. Don't stress. You're okay, bro. Just count to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. You're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! Whoa. What the fuck? How? How can that be? I was in the bathroom. He shot that poor girl. I held up my hand. And then I was back here. Yeah, she likely was. These pieces of time can frame us. I already heard this lecture. From light to shadow. From color. Now Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Now, Shit. Can you give me an example of a Man, photographer I cannot believe who this. captured the human condition in black and white? Okay, if I'm crazy, Anybody? I might as well go all the way. Bueller. Can I actually reverse time? There you go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Now, I actually did it. Photographer who perfectly captured I'm a human the human time machine. Anybody? Bueller? Max, don't Not freak yet. out. Not yet. There you go, Victoria. Why Arvis? Because of her Keep it together, Max. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers. When I took my selfie, Jefferson asked me a question. Tortured, right? If he does again, I'll know this is for real. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie, a dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I know I'm not dreaming course, this. You all know, the it's real. Has been I can tell. The early 1800s. Your generation so I can go back in time. For selfie expression. What if that girl so, isn't dead yet? I couldn't resist. The point Can I save that her? Portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography. For I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, <laughs> since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? I think it'd be more realistic if I say I felt sick. I'm sorry. I feel sick. May I be excused? I try, Max. But you're not gonna get away that easy. We can talk more after class. Is there anybody oh, here shit. who knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me he after class. And I need time to save that girl. Nights. A process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind the again process, and give him the right answer? Detail in people's faces. Make let's try rewinding. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do it. Let's do it. Just forget her. Forget her. She's a bitch. Yeah, we're gonna hold shift and rewind faster. Let's do it. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Obviously, the that. Bavarian process, invented by a French painter named Louis Daguerre around 1830. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Nice work, Max. <sighs> the Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular. 
mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. But you can learn more when you actually. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Chapters. Didn't mean to do that. So far, way ahead of everybody. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an Everyday Hero. Nothing different, is there? Even if you're submitting your photo for the competition, everybody in class is turning in a photo, so... You see the dilemma? I know, Mr. Jefferson. I just worked so hard in the shot. And it sure doesn't look like anything is different here. That girl needs your help now. I just want to see... Stop this bullshit and go save that girl. <laughs> if I want to be an everyday hero, I better go save that girl. I want to see how many different lines I can get. Not not that I'm like don't care for the girl, but girl needs your help now. Okay, it's starting to loop. Let's get out of here. Let's go. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. You kidding? I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. I'm not avoiding, just... Biding time? Waiting for the elusive right moment? Exactly. Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Wait, press control to quickly undo your previous... Let's try that. And I'm sure you know what it's like to be consumed by your work. I just really think every day here... Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future... Let's skip that. <laughs> um... Yeah, that. I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max. You're on fire today. All the right answers. Good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. Alright. Can I leave now, please? We need, get, we need to get over there. We need to get there. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. I can't have to walk anybody. faster. They'll think I'm crazy. Just, you know... You remember the payday? No, I don't tease. I hate that science class. Let's go. Nerds. Okay, Max, retrace every step. I washed my face. I shredded my photo. Then the butterfly flew in. And I took a photo. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where did you get that? What are you doing? Don't Come on, put that thing down. Tell me what to do. Wowzer, it's half. I need a hammer to break it open. You are going to get in hella more trouble. Looks for like this Samuel than forgot to take the cleaning cart out of here. Missed your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Holy shit, I can't let this happen. If I can reverse time again, I can help her. What? Shit, come on. There we go. Missed your punk ass, would they? Get that gun, Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh. You kidding me? Shit. Okay, let's, let's faster, 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 faster. All the way back. Don't okay. Don't ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get. I need help. Oh wait, I already picked it up. I already picked it up. I already picked it up. Would ever even miss your punk ass would that? No way. Don't ever touch me again, freak. Another shitty day. That did not happen. This cannot be real. 
I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Do not freak out. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Yeah, shit face. Get out of here. Nobody likes you. Everybody always hates the security guys. Let's go. You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm... I'm just a little worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You can always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. I did something wrong to, uh, do something right. I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott? You sure? Yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know, I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family and one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. So what happened next? Then... then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you going to bust him? This is serious charge I'll look into the matter personally thank you for bringing it to my attention that's it after what I told we'll you we'll continue this discussion later in my office please go outside with the rest of your class now Miss Caulfield of course this academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now should I rewind and change my story I almost want to. I almost want to. Oh, we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. We are gonna rewind all the way. You look a little stressed out. And hide the truth. I just got sick in class. Um, female trouble. Except you're wandering around like a zombie. And do you think that's the first time a student has used that line on me? It's the truth. I felt dizzy in Mr. Jefferson's just class. Just tell me what you're hiding. You can trust me. There's nothing to hide. I got sick. It happens, you know. There's that teen toot again. You know, I've, I've heard enough. Don't think I don't know what goes on around here. You've only been here for three weeks, and you're already causing conflict. I don't think your parents will approve when they find out. Now get outside with class. Please. No, he does not buy that at all. I may have just flushed my scholarship down the toilet. Yes, I could rewind and actually tell him the truth. Uh, I like the other option better. The other option felt better. Give me a moment, just reaching for your jacket coat. Jacket coat? Yes, jacket coat. Whoops. You look a little stressed up. Let's skip here. Let's report him again. Let's and then skip through this. And okay. I'm gonna take that option over the other one. I'd rather him know and do nothing than me get in trouble. With Nathan 
Prescott, please come to the front office. Thank you. Rachel Amber. She looks so hopeful and pretty. I wonder what happened to her. Ah, uh, jeez. Hi, Miss Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? I guess. Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. Crazy. That's crazy. I get why school should be on high alert these days, but cameras in the dorm rooms. It's a slippery slope, and it's up to you and your classmates to stand up here. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage, from the Native Americans who founded this land to the pioneers who shared it in peace, not fear and violence. Wait, the Native Americans? The Native Americans? The tribes who were here first who welcomed the settlers. Both cultures found a mutual symbiosis and thrived. Now, before I assign you homework with this lecture, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? <laughs> 1984. So wait, 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 I'm signing to keep the, keep the, the cameras out? Because then I will. I don't mind security, but not your surveillance. I knew you were my favorite new student at Blackwell for a good reason. Best teacher. I will take those consequences. Huh? Dear God. Wait, 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 wait. Scroll back up. I couldn't read that fast. Let's bust shit up! Yeah! Let's do it! Wait, I have to study for a physics test, so if we bust anything, we have, we have to measure its velocity! <laughs> okay. Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Um, okay. What's over here? I'm gonna sit. Sit my bum down. This day has been so insane. Can I pull up my... I can. Cool. So, um, objective. I need to go to my room to get Warren's flash drive. Cool, it shows my objective here. This does not exist. What? There's the butterfly. I believe they uh, return. I, I believe they refer to this to the to be the uh, butterfly effect. Yes. Oh my God! What's going on here? Oh, this is page one again. Yikes! So this, do huh? I, I don't know. I don't know what to think anymore. Monday. Look at that. Monday. What's up here? So we got David. We don't like him. We don't like him. He's bad. Nobody likes him. We got the principal. Nobody likes him. Hey, you're not the boss of me! Nathan. Apparently he's a druggie with lots of money because his family's rich. Alright, cool. It's happening too fast. And none of it makes any sense. These visions, this power. It is definitely the... Well, like, either the best or the worst of all possible possible uh, abilities that you could have gained. We're just gonna kind of do this jog thing. Hello, bird. I must get to the bird. No, I want to get to the bird. All right, fine, fine. Loading screen. Loading screens are like non-existent though, so it's the thing. 
Did that stutter? I'm pretty sure that's what happened there. I need to go All to right. the room and return Warren's flash drive. Construction going on here. Alyssa. Yeah. The bitches. Where's my room? Do we need to go past the bitches? Oh look, it's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. The Daguerrean processor. No. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh, yes, Victoria. Wow. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. Okay. We're gonna take we're gonna take advantage of this. I don't wanna mess with that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. Are you sure? I just want to get Victoria the hell out of the way. Dude. I know, a, I know a pretty good way to do this. You sure? There goes Samuel Da Vinci to paint the window. I mean, I, I think we could just use the ladder and climb on in, you know? What's back here? Oh, so we actually do have to... Uh, I'd rather just not deal with her. <laughs> That's what I do when people piss me off. Hey, I don't want to deal with you. Uh oh. <laughs> do you understand English? Get lost. Um, how about no? There's got to be. I don't know. What's this? Rachel owes me money. Pay up, bitch! I bumped my mic by accident. Sorry about that. If it made a noise. I don't know. Probably didn't even make a noise. Um. I need to figure this out. Huh? Why am I... For what reason do I need to rewind? Huh? I'm not quite getting it. It won't let me mess with the ladder, so that must not be it. Keep walking, hippie. Slut. I'm not quite sure what I need to do. No. I'm gonna walk right next to you. I'm gonna walk all up in your face. No. Um. I I don't know. She just looks stoned. <laughs> What's this? I must have missed something. I should rewind. It's something to do with the paint bucket, but I'm not too sure. Would you stop that? Go all the way back. What's this? What the hell? Are you kidding? Ha! <laughs> Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. 
Do you understand English? Get lost. She looks like a pissed off wet cat, and she's still stylish. Do you understand English? Get lost. I can't grab that. Samuel is way too close. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I get you. Whoops. Whoops, whoops, whoops. That way. Okay, let's see if this works. <laughs> no way! No fucking you okay, way! Okay, Victoria. Oh, Sam, you're sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair. Nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo! Oh, dude. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I drive. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. Whoops, whoops, whoops. I keep uh, pressing the wrong button. Hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? Ah. Uh... Don't. Don't say a word, Max. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. And no filter needed before I post this. Now please move. I've had a messed up day and I'm going to my room. No. You do that? I know where you live. So does Nathan. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Now I have to get to my room, then see Warren. No. You know what? I'm gonna do it though. We're gonna go with it. Threaten me with Nathan? Fine, I don't care. Got time travel, bitches. Hey, Courtney. What? Room 217? Victoria, no way in hell am I ever going in here. What does that say? Red rum? Is that what that's supposed to say? Taylor is a slave. That sounds accurate. Is this a Vortex Club or a Victoria Club initiation? Truly. Stomp on Bigfoot? Dane is still a cheerleader at heart. Juliet, extreme reporter. You people have minimal lives going on here. <laughs> nice atmospheric shot. Needs dusting. Well, shit. What the fuck, toilet paper? Looks like nobody won this TP war. There's nothing left but ghosts. At least that's an alarm from this century. <laughs> That's funny. Be alert on campus. Observe the following this or er, tips for your safety. Always be aware of your location. Always let a friend know where you are uh, or or where you're going. Always report any incident immediately to the campus authorities. Hey, we did that. Don't worry about it. To download a free campus alert app, go to yeah, screw that. Hello, showers. I see you. They built this entire area and I can't explore you. That's upsetting. Missing persons poster again. Another poster. Whoops, whoops. I keep doing that. They live. <laughs> we'll bang. Gee, what? What? Okay, this is just mean and stupid. We'll bang for Jesus. That's what it said. I, I caught it last second that it was a four. Yeah, peace! This action will have consequences. Nobody knows it was me! I'm out, bye! <laughs> this is like the public DNA of our dorm. I'd believe it. Somebody spelled night wrong. How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. Oh, Victoria, give me a fucking break. Her door's open. It's slightly cracked open. Pie. Warren should be all over Brooke. They're perfect for each other. Oh my. <laughs> 